Okay guys, so the first thing that we're going to do is fill in our eyebrows. We're just going to go ahead and just brush them really good. So now that I've basically brushed them into place, I'm going to go ahead and take my eyebrow pencil. And I'm going to go ahead and fill in any sparse areas. Okay, so now that we've done the eyebrows, what we're going to do is we're going to take this. And we're just going to go ahead and brush the front of the brow. Okay, so now that I've basically brushed the front to go ahead and fade it a little bit, we're going to go ahead and take that concealer. This is my newer one. The concealer and take the brush I use to define my brows and we're going to go ahead and we're going to um, highlight and define those brows. Okay guys, so now that I've done my eyebrows and don't they look pretty, we're going to go ahead and we're going to take our concealer and we're going to place them in all the places that we want to highlight or contour. So the place that I want to do is right here down the middle to my nose. And we're just going to bring it out some for the forehead. You don't have to do too much on the forehead just because we did the brows. So you already have a little bit of concealer from there. Going to do right under the eyes. And do like an upside down triangle. And just do the other side. We're on our notes right here and around the lips. Okay. So those are all the places that um, I usually highlight and contour. I'm still new at this, but this is basically what I do. So when I come back, we're going to start blending. Okay? okay, so before we start blending, actually what we're going to do is we're going to put the parts, um, I guess the brown shadow, we're going to go ahead and put that all over our face. So I'm just going to take eyeshadow brush and I'm just going to take any brown, and I chose the darkest brown from my 120 um, palette from BH Cosmetics, and I just tap off the excess because we don't want to do too much. And I just go right where I want to contour. Just like that. Then I do the other side. just like that and then I go ahead and take my foundation brush and go ahead okay so now it's time to start blending we're just gonna go ahead and take our foundation brush we're just gonna go ahead and blend in all those areas that we put the concealer okay, so the next place we're gonna go ahead and do under the eyes So we just did under the eyes, now we're going to do right here on the bottom of your chin basically or the side of your face. Now we're going to go ahead and we're just going to rub in this area right here and then rub in the concealer on the lips and my lips are always blue, purple and all of that and red because I have like a horrible like habit of picking my lips I do not know why and it's disgusting but this concealer saves my lips so that you know when I put the lipstick on the gloss on you know everything goes on smooth and evenly and it doesn't look you know horrible <laughs> so you can go ahead and just smooth that now in. for the best part we're gonna go ahead and blend in the nose the nose is always the best part to me I'm gonna go ahead and take the brush and we're just gonna blend in this area right here bring that down and then go ahead and do those sides as well and when I blend it as much as I possibly could with the foundation brush, I go in with my fingers. Your fingers are your best blending tool sometimes because of the heat from your fingers, the moisture and everything. It'll blend everything perfectly, so I just go ahead and... and uh... 
Okay, so you're basically all done blending. What you're going to go ahead and do is take a brush and we're going to go ahead and just fluff in that, those sides that we put the brown eyeshadow in at first. Okay, so now that I'm basically all done, as you can see, I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to place some foundation on. And I use powder foundation and I'm just going to go ahead and evenly distribute that okay so now that i'm done with the foundation we're just going to go ahead and add some blush and bronzer and then going to go ahead and apply some lipstick i'm just going to use this blush right here i don't even know if you can see the true color but it is pretty there you go this light is like beaming today and then we're going to go ahead and with some lipstick and we're going to do True Ebony, which is a beautiful brown. Okay, so I applied the lipstick, and isn't it pretty? And it's just from Kiss, but that brown is so pretty. Color payoff is beautiful, and you don't have to apply too much. But this is basically the whole entire look together. Let me bring it in close. I love that blush. Cheeks are so rosy. And that is basically my full coverage face whenever I have time to basically go in and beat this face. <laughs> I definitely do and it is gorgeous. I have just started learning how to contour but let me tell you I am in love with it. It is so, it does a lot for your face. It really does. It's really slimming and it's just really, really pretty. So if you like this contouring, let me know. Watch some of my older videos as well because I have contouring in them as well. And I guess you guys have a good day and I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.